I mean, people want to BM you. That's you don't want to stoop to their level. Well, unless it's a villa, then then I don't I don't mind. I don't mind. I don't mind chirping with the villa, man. I, I had fun with that yesterday. I'll be, I'll be honest with you guys. Basic tips for a newer Protoss player: uh, value your army. Uh, when you think you're going to be really committing to attack, make sure you bring your mothership core because you know it, you might need to recall. You might have misjudged your spot in the game. Uh, you get sentries versus Zerg because you want to be hallucinated scouting, getting a piece of their tech. Uh, Blink Stalker Disruptors can work in every single matchup. Uh, in, ob in PvT, Observers are your friend. Get a couple of them. Make sure, I mean, that's the best way you deal with drops, so Observers are good. So, I mean, just in general, man, vision is important. Your army is not easily replaced. And, uh, you've chose the funnest race in the entire game, man, so have some fun with it. That's, that's my tips for you, dude. What's up, Josh? You how you doing, man? Dank Starcraft. You didn't make the clan. The, you didn't make the M Clanning clan, man. The M Clanning clan. The man Sammy Sweets. <laughs> he made that for me, dude. I uploaded it to my YouTube uh, Fatty Hate Load. You miss? I mean, if, it's on his vod. It's on his vod. If you want to go through his last night, his, his most recent vod. It's probably funnier from his camp point of view. But I missed about six minutes of my game because I lagged out in the middle of my Abilo game, so. But, uh, yeah. So I lagged out about halfway through, which is pretty unfortunate. PVT here, though. I mean, see, this is one of those things, right? You guys are like, oh my god, like, how have you not scouted yet? And, like, I don't even really need to scout. Because, you know, he comes out here. Oh, crap. I probably wouldn't join. I was a part of the M-Clanning, but... I I joined a group, but not a clan. I don't... I don't love, uh... I don't like having the clan time, man. I like being clean. Help your fan base grows during Legacy. Thank you, man. Appreciate that. Fat barracks, huh? I mean, so I mean, a lot of times when you play StarCraft, guys, you want you want to like I mean, you're gonna have a CC, right? The story you tell us, right? So it's the thing where like you kind of try to read the story that they tell you, right? I mean, that's like half of what you're trying to trying to learn, honestly. Is like, well, like, what story is he telling you, right? I mean, I go to his base. Even if I didn't see this barracks, right? I see 1860, and I see, a f and I see a Reaper opener, right? So I know he's got 40 gas to spare, right? I mean, if it costs 50 for a Reaper, he's got, or I guess you'd have 100. You'd have 100, almost 100 gas to spare. But I mean, you would be lower. Zaijin, thanks for that follow, man. Oh man. Can I catch him sleeping? But so like, we were pretty much, we would have been able to guess that the barracks follow up was happening. Even without scouting it. Are you somewhere out here just killing up, waiting for my adept to prey on you? Apparently not. Apparently not. A proxy oracle is good, they're not bad, man. They're not bored. You can get away with them. So this game, right, I can open Blink, and then I can open a couple gateways. I don't need to force out that Robo Bay because, well. We know that we don't need the railway bay that much. Because he's going racks. He's not going to be going Widowmine. At least not opening Widowmine. Oh, that's pretty good, man. What's up, Ben Richards? How you doing, man? I think Colo opener is okay, but I would try to keep it to like two Colo losses, man. I would maybe, maybe three. But I would love to see that switch to disruptors, man. There's no way to get better at disruptors than just using them, man. So you might be bad with them, and they might be, you might lose a handful of games by opening disruptors, man. But dude, they're so much, they're so much better. If you can get in the habit of transitioning into them, dude. It'd be really, really nice. What well, control hot groups did I change? What do you mean? From when? These are pretty much the ones I've created. Now I'll be able to scout a bit. I mean, I'm getting a century. I don't see too much. It's a bit scary, but not too bad. I guess I could do something like this. So, I mean, I don't see any of his units. Could he be going for, like, 5 racks opener? I would doubt it. I would still expect him to be doing something somewhat standard. 
I want to get a couple forges, probably. The only winning strategies? No, there's other strategies, man. Are they the most strong? Are they the strongest and probably most reliable? I would say yes. But you can definitely win with other things, man. You can definitely win with other things. Don't feel like, well, if I don't go Disruptors, I'll lose every game. Well, I mean, well, I would say I would say you'd probably win the most games if you open Disruptor every game, but do you have to open Disruptor every game? No. You don't. I would recommend that you try to be more comfortable with them, but, you know, I understand they're a hard unit for a lot of people. So, makes sense to me, man. So, I mean, if you don't trust yourself with them, you probe. Then uh, you know you can try some other other strategies. But you want to get immortal, I think. But you guys can see, right? Look at my map vision right now. It's pretty dang good. Pretty dang good, man. Oh man, it's a pretty big push, and it looks like he's staying on two bases for it. Can I end up holding? This could be a mistake. He's on two bases, right? So this could be a mistake for me. See you later, PC, PC Collective. Take it easy, man. Enjoy your night, man. This is a big army. It's a big army for not to have disruptors for. Where is he dropping? I definitely want to be getting adepts to help buffer my army. Make sure I follow SCE. Oh, it's so it's pretty tough. I don't like that choice though. I don't like that choice from him. He should have fought me. I think he could have fought me. Now he is going home. He hasn't taken the space because I'm underneath it. Teach me how to play Protoss. I will, man. I'm doing good, Beastie. How you doing, dude? Good beast. Let's see if I can be annoying. I'd love to see if I could be annoying. Maybe that time is not now yet. Is that a drop pushing out? Oh my god. Holy crap. So I'm gonna definitely want to, he's gonna scan my main for sure. I've been climbing it, uh, I've been climbing it, just not upwards. We've been uh, a little bit little bit of a scuffle this at this today, but you know it's alright. It happens sometimes. You can't win every night, right? Oh my god, I didn't even get that. Oh god, the Widow Mines. Well, the good thing about those Widow Mine shots... The good thing about those Widow Mine shots... Is, uh, I have a lot of army to switch to this base. I imagine he still has them here, doesn't he? I'm pushing out now. Screw this guy. They'll probably just doom drop me now. Maybe. So I was right about that. Oh 
boy. Oh boy. That got ugly right there. So he's just kind of lurking around. He's uh, just kind of picking some spots. I saw Liberators over here. Oh man. I'm gonna have blink in a second. Not enough though. I mean, look at my map vision. It's pretty. I mean, it's pretty good, right? I definitely want to leave something back at home. It's got to have some sort of other drop around, I'm thinking. If that's his army, I'm not that scared of it. I see his army here. I see the Widow Mines. Looks like he is staying at home. Got ghosts? That's interesting. I think I'm okay with this, honestly, aren't I? Then he has not expanded yet. I guess I can use one of these shades to scout. So he definitely wants to be expanding right now. Try to let him push out, maybe. Well, that's pretty good. Hopefully, he doesn't do a doom drop, though. That'd be less good. I mean, this should make it really hard for him to push out, though, right? He's going for that other base. The shall oh man, he should not have taken this fight. Or is it an okay fight for him? Looks like I could use more gates. I don't care about like the liberators if I kill everything else, right? So now that I've killed like most of his ground. Liberators are much less of a threat. Well he's got a lot of liberators, so I should be careful I guess. I'm on three three though. Over here. Doom dropping, maybe? I think he is doom dropping. Where was the rest of his army? Maybe it's just me kind of keeping up the aggression? I mean, I was taking some okay fights, but my macro was slipping a bit. Pretty cool game, though. What's up, Soul Dirge? How you doing, man? I mean, he had a pretty good game, right? I mean, he was really trying to keep us back with those drops, and I had to split my army into my stalkers and some other things. Right? I mean, we really had to split up our army both spots. So, Terran.